We are back with an Easter version of Snack Attack. Do 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 do. Cue the music. So we have six different Easter treats. They are all British Easter treats that uh, I saw and I wanted to try because I realized I just really like Easter candy. I really? think it might be my favorite candy holiday. I always thought the camera. The camera like... does not like this. <laughs> I always thought that um, Valentine's Day was my favorite uh, favorite candy holiday. Yeah. But thinking about it more, you know, Halloween is pretty generic flavor wise. It's just like normal candy. It's just a lot of candy. True. Christmas is a lot of minty candy. Yeah. Which I'm not a huge fan of minty candy. Like, it's okay. It's not my favorite. Valentine's Day is decadent. A lot of chocolate. But not necessarily like special flavors. But Easter has a lot of really unique flavors. And a lot of really unique candies and sweets and stuff. So uh, I think it's my favorite candy holiday. I don't really particularly have any, you know favorite holiday when it comes to candy i don't i mean growing up you you were not raised with this yeah, candy I mean, tradition growing up like in, we were in, in southeast asia i mean we we don't really have candy holidays candy holiday candy was like you a, have a special like sweet treat. holidays yeah but, but i mean not... you want sweet you want sugar you eat fruit right or moon so, cakes or, or, or moon cakes but yeah yeah i i but you know come to think about yeah i guess so i guess there's different between holidays and their their chocolate or their mm -hmm. candy but there, there are differences and i really like the easter ones and uh i also am like a trash candy fan i really like peeps i really <laughs> want some peeps but i can't Literally justify just like getting an entire sugar. box of them i was so tempted and i resisted oh god <laughs> i ressisted you should be so proud of me I, Especially because is, I'm pregnant right now. Maybe, maybe we, we should be so have, proud of me. Maybe we should have just gotten one just to try it. You can't just get one though. I mean, well, it's get, like a whole box. Get a box and then eat like one eight and then marshmallows. Give it to your family. Give it I don't to know your... if they want them. I know, but I, but I just really like Peeps. It's been too long it's since I've had that, it. It's just that like that crunchy sugar on the outside it's and so mar gross. I love marshmallows <laughs> it's and so gross. I don't know. I just love them. I also really like jelly beans. I think I had it like once in I my really life. I really like jelly beans too. Well, jelly bean is so, good. Jelly bean is good, especially. I, I have some jelly beans. They're not on our our menu for snack attack today. Oh. But I do have some jelly beans, just because I was like, I can. I'm I'm making Easter baskets for my family, so I was like, I can put this in the Easter basket. It's fine. Um. So, anyways, but what we have today is six different types of British Easter candy. So some of these are things that we've that I've tried before. Some of a lot of them are things that I've never tried and uh, just kind of looked interesting. So I don't know how common all of these, if these are all things that like British people are like, oh yeah, we have these all the time, every Easter. Or if it's like, oh no, those are actually like unusual candies for us too. I don't know. Um, but they look tasty. So let's get into it. They look definitely interesting. <clears throat> you have, uh, so let's see, you have pre uh dissected <laughs> i put together you have a little tasting plate for us yeah. of all of these candies they're, they're kind of uh they're kind of cute <laughs> I, I i'm gonna try to attempt to hold it up can you lift and it up without making a mess see if okay now I'm, he's just you know i'm just gonna drop it combine all. them i'm all. just gonna drop it all he's but... mixed i had them oh in no the order they, and it? he's oh, mixed no. them all up <laughs> Oh no! Never mind. I'm just okay. I think I got it. I think it's okay. Okay. I'll All just right. I'll just play by you know on cue. Just okay. just show me what you got, and I'll try to match it. All right. Let's try the first one. So the first candy that we have is something that I've had. Um, we have these in the U.S. or at least we did. I feel like it's gotten harder to find these as the the years have gone on. Mm -hmm. But it's those Cadbury cream eggs. Mm. Um. But which, which one is it's this? The one with the white and the orange in the middle. The one with the white. Okay, okay, I see. It's I like a little can... helmet. These. It's kind of adorable. One. It's like a little helmet. Yeah. yeah, okay. Um, but the ones that we have in the US are very gooey on mm -hmm. the inside. Like you break it open and it just kind yeah. of like goo. I it see. oozes out. I see. Whereas this is like cream, but it's not the same consistency. So it is, uh 
I'm curious. For everyone who's watching and listening, it is a very hot day. We picked the hottest day. It's in the 90s. Yeah. Through, like is... all across Southern California. It is in the 90s today. So I'm... I'm... So, of course, we're eating chocolate today. It's, yeah, the reason I mentioned that, because I'm just holding up just a little tad bit, <laughs> it's and it's all it's melting in, in my finger already. Okay, let's try these. So, we're going to try it. Smells very chocolatey. I'm trying to smell the inside of it, but, I, you know, it's cute, though. I mean, it's kind of cool, the inside of it. There's a little half orange, half white. Wait, what is mm -hmm. it that you say again that's inside of it? It's the Cadbury cream egg. What is that supposed to so be? It's just like, it's like a fondant cream. Oh, okay, so it's not like marshmallow, orange oh, flavor. Mm -mm, mm -mm. I'm I'm here just expecting it to be mm -mm. fruity and and interesting, but okay. Hmm. Yeah, like again, it's hot today, so <laughs> it's very it's like melting. Pre-melted. Mm. So, I would actually say these are a bit different than the ones that we get in the U.S. The chocolate layer is thicker. Mm. In the U.S., I, I think the chocolate is very thin. Mm -hmm. Um. I think the flavor of the chocolate is similar. I don't have an American cream egg to compare because mm -hmm. I thought that's what I was getting. I thought they were going to be the same. I didn't realize they were different cream eggs. Um, but it's it's a much thicker layer of chocolate uh, compared to what I remember. And then, like I said, the inside, it tastes the same, but mm -hmm. it's not as gooey mm -hmm. as the American cream egg usually is. It's tasty, though. It's um, yeah, kind of a, a milky flavor. Mm -hmm um not not super random or special or anything but it's tasty yeah i think it would, would have been cool for me at least to try the other one the american one like i said i them. i thought they were going to be the same i didn't yeah. realize they were different otherwise i would have it's really just good to compare them it's really good it's really smooth uh halfway through i feel like i'm eating um peanut butter i'm like the texture mm. yeah a little bit <laughs> i can't, I can't. <laughs> do anything with my mouth i can't talk blah, it's kind of sticky it's not as <laughs> sticky as peanut butter though it's really good really mm -hmm. smooth candy number two this is a kinder brand candy and these are these cute little uh milk chocolate figurines and they are actually hollow um but what i didn't realize and i really like is there a toy is no, there's not oh, a toy no, 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 there's not a toy <laughs> but they are just like those kinder eggs yeah and i love kinder eggs when i was when i was a kid uh, my dad used to go on business trips and i guess he would go on business trips to to europe like on a somewhat regular basis and every single time he would smuggle back kinder eggs because like kinder eggs are not allowed in the u.s because they have something non-edible inside which is apparently like against the rules we can't handle that in the u.s um but yeah he would he would smuggle back kinder eggs and that was just like my favorite thing. And we have a sort of version of Kinder Eggs in the US now, but it's not the same. It's not the same. Is it not? No. It d doesn't taste the same? No, because they do that weird, like there's like the scoopable, like one half is the candy. Yeah. I mean, one half is the toy and the other half is an egg, but then it's got a filling that's like scoopable. So it's not the same it's tasty yeah last it time. tastes like kinder chocolate we have gotten them that's what i mean but like it's well, not I mean, the same of course it's not the same because we like we in the u.s like to sue everybody so we can't put candy yeah. inside of of uh yeah we can't put toys inside of candy but yeah but i i think you i've had it a couple times that you gave it to me and i thought it was we tasty which one the, 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 the american can, ones yeah or the, the american one yeah they're good yeah i thought that was tasty they're good but they're, it's just not quite the same yeah well, anyways, these things, just so you know, when I saw that on here, I spent maybe a minute just thinking about like, did I, uh, or did you drop some the the filling inside or something? Because <laughs> I was like, why did you just give me a little piece of these are hollow? Oh my god, hollow they're, figurines. they're so melty. It's so warm oh. today that I'm like, it's very melty. I'm actually, I can form this into a little. You know, I can sculpt this into Do something. not play with your food. <laughs> yeah. mm. But it's that very, like, mm. white mm. chocolate, milk chocolate, mm. smooth, delicious. Mm -hmm. Tastes just like a Kinder Egg, mm. like a, a European Kinder Egg. That was actually when we went to mm. Europe a few years ago. 
That was the very first thing we bought there was a Kinder Egg. We yeah, went to in, this little like corner in store in London because mm -hmm. we wanted we needed to get like water. We wanted to get bottles of water. And the first thing we did, they had right? Kinder Eggs. Mm -hmm. And we were like, or rather, I was like, yeah, I got to get these. And I was like, oh, I got some toys. I got a lot of Kinder Eggs on that trip. <laughs> Probably tossed them. We bought so many Kinder Eggs already. on that trip. <laughs> Yeah, it was really, uh, this is really good. I like this much better I, than the first one. Yeah, uh, that's my favorite so far. Yeah. But I'm also predisposed towards loving Kinder chocolate. Yeah. I it's, just really like it's, it. It's, uh, it's not as um, strong as the first one. It's a bit smoother. It's, it's smoother. It's not and, so overwhelming. Yeah. Like it's, I can eat a bunch of them. <laughs> you could eat an entire figurine. I can. I can. I'm sure you could. Wait, what was it? Oh, it, was it just an egg? The, the, Which one? The half? You gave me the half of it. No, no, the no. These were these forms. were the little um, figurines. Oh, they're oh. like the chick and the rooster. It mine didn't look like half of a well, chick. Well, because I didn't Did you give you the, the whole thing. <laughs> Did you eat the other? Half? Did you that eat was the like most the head. <laughs> okay, okay. That I makes took sense. the head and I cut it in half. For <laughs> that us makes sense. Though. Instead of the whole thing, because we're eating a lot of chocolate today. <laughs> You can have more That's later. A if you want. That's a good idea. That's a good idea. We have <laughs> we have, we have, we a, have a lot of chocolate more to get through. All right, so the next one that we have is back to Cadbury. Okay. Uh, this was actually in egg form, and this okay. was an Oreo egg. The Cadbury oh, Oreo is that, egg. Is that what it's... Yeah, so that's Oreo that's what... filling. Uh-huh. And I've got the other half of the egg. <laughs> yeah, that's what it is. Okay. I was wondering what is... Why is there speck of black stuff <laughs> inside of it? Is it like pepper? Yeah, I, we keep seeing these, these like uh, Cadbury Oreo um, collaborations, hmm. and I don't know if the um, if the brands are like connected in some way. Is Oreo an American no idea. thing? I think so. Hmm. Nabisco yeah, that's what Oreo? I would. That's what I would I think know. too. <laughs> I don't know. Who who else in the world make weird things like this? <laughs> Only American. Um, I think it is, but like, don't quote me on that. I'm not 100 yeah, percent sure. Yeah. But, um, but then again, I thought Nutella was American. You and did, then and then it's not. And then we were proven wrong. And so if you're, you think Nutella is American, it's not. you're wrong. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I I do love when we were working with some some German people, and they came over to the U.S. and uh, they were like buying stuff from Costco because they were staying in this like house while they were here, and they were like. Okay, we need the Costco tub of Nutella. <laughs> it's got to happen. I still so, don't know why. Is this is Nutella. They is probably from... put it on like toast or something for no, breakfast. No, no, I mean, or... I mean. What do you mean you could, don't know why? Don't they have it's... enough in, you know, of Nutella in Europe? that It's they... not that they oh, don't they just... have enough. It's kind of more just like, okay, you're we're going to be here for, I don't oh, know, how long? I, I a see. week or something. So, so wanna... like what foods do you need? Yeah. I While see. we're here I to see. like have a good breakfast and stuff, I see. It's like and so it's that like, was like one of the things. It's, it's, it's it wasn't like, like something me, special or anything. It's like me being in Asia and wanting to. I mean, me being in like Europe and wanting to take uh, those, you know, those Korean uh, noodle ramen, you know, those <laughs> those uh, instant ramen uh -huh. with me, just so I can have something. So to you eat have to something feel like familiar and tasty from home. Yeah, 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 yeah. Exactly. Okay, I get it. Yeah, I get it. yeah. I think that's why. Because they just wanted, you know, kind of their, was, their uh, familiar breakfast. Yeah, no, see. it wasn't something special. I see. Um, but anyways, so... Let's let's get into this or Let's what? try this, yeah. This is massive. Oh. I'm just taking a bite of it. Mmm. 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 That is good. That is very... Mm hmm Very rich. Very, mm -hmm. You know what it, it reminds me of? It doesn't taste like American Oreo stuff. No. But what it does taste like, and I don't know if you remember this, is do you remember when we made that Oreo cake? That like instant Oreo or like packaged Oreo box tort hmm. thing. We have a video of it on this channel. Yeah. And we made that a couple of years ago for my brother for his birthday. Mm. And it tastes like that. Yeah, 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 yeah. <clears throat> It does not. You're right. Which was that was also an Oreo Cadbury thing. Mm. It's so it's the same. Yeah, very tasty. I like it. It's it's more, um, you know, like the milky candies. No, I'm not. Are you really... familiar with the milky brand? Yes, I do. But um, 
or like Hokkaido milk mm -hmm. sort of flavors. It tastes like that with bits of Oreo cookie mixed in. Mm -hmm. It doesn't taste like the center of an Oreo to me at all. Um, but it's, yeah, it tastes much milkier than, than Oreos normally do. I like it. It's one, tasty though. One thing I don't like about it, well, I'm not sure if I don't like about it. It's just a little interesting is that, you know how it's, it's all these little speckle of, of, um, mm -hmm. of black, uh, things in there. It's very grainy. Mm -hmm. It's very grainy. I spent a bunch of time just kind of like, but it's interesting. Texture. Those are the cookie bits. Yeah. It's, I guess you can, you know, think about it. You can think of it as it gives as that crunch of the cookie. Yeah. Otherwise, if you just had the flavor, I don't know if it would really feel so Oreo. But True. I think having having those bits gives that crunch. It feels very much like eating an Oreo. Yeah, it's definitely not as <laughs> like you said, it's definitely not as Oreo -y as as what you as like American Oreos. that we're used to. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's really interesting. Yeah, really it's not good. bad though. I like it. Really good. It's, it's I don't know between this one and the, the previous one. I, I think the know. Kinder is still my favorite so far. I kind of like this one. It's it's a little oh. bit more creamy, maybe. Okay. It's, there's something okay. to it. It's, it's I, maybe I like the texture. I like the little bit of a, the squishiness of it all, <laughs> and then the the little grain. Interesting. Yeah, it's interesting. So that's why I, I didn't want to say that I dislike it. Okay, it's so it's not bad. It's just odd to yeah. you. Yeah, I okay. didn't expect it to be so grainy. Okay. But okay. but it's at the end of the day, I think I that makes it more interesting. All righty. You ready to move on to the next one? Yes. Okay. This is another Cadbury. This is the Easter Bunny with orange flavored mousse filling. Oh, there's filling in this one. Mm-hmm. <laughs> They're all so, melting. Uh, we, we have. <laughs> They're so melting. We each have an ear. Oh, I see. Yeah. We each got an ear and it's got that filling inside. I think if I hold this up long enough, you can start to see that it's <laughs> uh, melting. Oh, very melting. Oh, God. Ooh, that's good. I think, oh, look, it's, it's so squishy now. It's all melting. Mine is all falling apart. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> it's like, no, don't eat me. Oh, God. Mmm. 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 I like this one. That's really good. Yeah. I really like this one. Mm. So I do very much like chocolate orange flavors. Mm -hmm. um, I'm a big, big fan of chocolate orange flavors. And this, the orange really comes through. It's um, definitely a melty sort of, well, obviously it's melty, but <laughs> it's one of those very smooth sort of mm. milk chocolates. Yeah. Um, that's really good. It's really, t really tasty. It's and, really um, good. I like fruit. I like fruity candy. I like fruity chocolate, fruity flavor with chocolate, and because it, it cuts down that 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 you know richness of the chocolate. So I think it's really good. And uh, you know, in some way, I'm thinking that um, you know, since it's such a hot day where we're at right now, and we're eating this chocolate, it's almost like nature is is melting it, pre melting it for you, <laughs> so that you don't have. You know, what, when it's really cold and you eat like this really hard piece of chocolate uh -huh. and you spend like, you spend like five minutes just melting in your mouth before you you know try to get all the get it get it to all melt down and you know meltiness of chocolate yeah but this thing. one is like it's already melted well it's already it's already done i just nature has done the work for <laughs> yeah. you yeah so i i thought it was a bad <clears> idea <throat> but actually i think it's a good idea that we did this on a hot day sun is really a baby bird in spirit he just wants things like chewed up and digested <laughs> yeah, for him. Just, just like, do all the I'm work. Lazy. All the work. That's why I'm. That's why we're programmers, right? We're just lazy. We yeah. Just automate all the things. Automate everything. Yeah. All right. Speaking of fruit and chocolate, fruit? this next one is also Cadbury. Um, it is a hot cross bun chocolate bar. Mm, it's kind of. And cute. it has raisins and cinnamon and crunch. Kind of cute. Wait, raisin and cin I will have it for the record that I am not sure about these raisins in my chocolate. Raisin and cinnamon crunch? It's what supposed is to taste like a hot cross bun. Which What's the hot cross pot bun? What is I, that? I like probably a... made them like maybe once. But um, they're a traditional Easter mm. um, like bread sort of thing. They're a little bit sweet. And a lot of the times they'll have like raisins 
or like dried fruit mm -hmm. in them. I feel like that's a very British thing to put dried fruit in like everything. Like fruit cake. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> that's what we get it from. Um, Makes sense. So anyways, Let's try it. Got, it's melting. I know. It's. I'm just, are you supposed to take a bite of it? Because I, I just put you. the whole thing in my mouth. Mm, okay, I got the. Did you get the raisin? I got the raisin. Mm -hmm. I also got the cinnamon crunch, which was very hard. Mm. I think I broke a tooth there. Really? No, not really, but it was surprisingly hard. Mm. <laughs> you see what I mean? Yeah. You got it. I don't know if they can hear him. Like, that's mm -hmm. a really hard crunch. Mm hmm. No, it's very. That's, it's like I'm eating. Um, it's like I drop a piece of chocolate on the ground and then pick it up. That's appetizing. <laughs> and, then, <laughs> and then proceed to eat it and then get some little bit of dirt and rocks in there. That's, that's exactly how it is. You're eating chocolate at the beach. Yeah. A little bit of sand in there. Mm hmm. Um,. Interesting texture. Yeah. Very interesting texture. I'm not sure how I feel about this one. The I chocolate mean, is good. Yeah. Like, I'm not going to complain about the chocolate. The chocolate's great. Um, the cinnamon crunch bits are quite hard. Mm -hmm. Surprisingly hard. Very crunchy. Um, I don't know that I'm getting that much cinnamon from it, but they're very yeah. crunchy. And uh then the raisin is... Um, I mean, to be fair, I'm I'm not really, I like raisins as raisins. Mm -hmm. I don't super love raisins in like cookies. Really? I, I or like cereal. It. I like raisins in, in everything. In general. I actually like it. I actually like that one. Not okay. not love it, but I like it. It's interesting. The texture again is interesting. Like, you got that chewiness from the I don't the hate it. Yeah. I would eat more. I'd say it's probably my least favorite of yeah. of the chocolates today. No, I think... But I, it's interesting. Yeah. It was it an is, experience. It is interesting texture. You that got, I'm not regretting having. It's crunchy. It's a little chewy. It it's is, a little yeah, confusing yeah. because I am i don't think it's I've ever confusing. had anything like that in chocolate form. Mm -hmm. um, it, the entire time I'm eating it, I'm, I'm just like trying to figure out what exactly it is. And like you said, maybe if I grow up eating the, the what's it the, the hot cross bun the hot cross bun then maybe it will be like oh hey you know this tastes it's, like it's it. also not something that i grew up eating right so that's not a super familiar flavor for me yeah. either but i can see how this would taste hot cross bun ish yeah the cinnamon is is definitely an aftertaste kind of thing like right now i can taste a, a little bit of it the cinnamon <laughs> but definitely not not enough and and it's probably best that way because i don't know if i like that much cinnamon you're, you're not a huge fan of cinnamon a little bit just to kind of uh you know i like, think i like cinnamon a lot more than you do just just to uh complement it rather than just you know overwhelming right so i think i think i i like it i enjoy okay. it i'll eat okay. it all righty so not too bad all right our last chocolate is by terry's and that is the company that makes those chocolate oranges that you smash them and the little orange sections come okay. apart. Do you know what I'm oh, talking yeah, about? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I do know. My mom do loves know those. Yeah, we, yeah, yeah. we, like, get them for my mom yeah. every year for Christmas. Yeah. Because uh, she's a huge fan of them. But they had these little chocolate orange egg things. Yeah. You know what? And I was excited because we love their chocolate oranges. And so I, I wanted see. to try this. So far, this one's the best in term of... Uh... I mean, best or worst depends on if you want nature to pre-melt this one for you. But this one I is mean, not melty at all. I feel like all. it's kind of like an M&M. &M, oh, Where I it's see. got like the candy shell. Oh, so it's I, not really. Yeah, so okay, you're I'm not holding like the chocolate it. bit right now. Yeah, I'm taking take a bite of it instead of yeah. just put it in my mouth. Oh, I mm. see what you're saying. It's mm -hmm. crunchy. Mm. Yeah. Oh, I see. So it's got that candy shell. You know what? I have not had this kind of candy or M&M &M either in such a long time. Mm. 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 Yeah, it tastes like the. Uh, no. It tastes like something I'm very familiar with. I mean, maybe it tastes like the orange one. The mm -hmm. the one, the, the. Not the previous one, but the one before, the one before that. that. Yeah. Interesting. It is interesting. Yeah. So I think between the orange things, 
Mm-hmm. I liked the um, the the bunny, the Cadbury one mm-hmm. better. Yep. Or like the original Terry's chocolate orange. Like I really really like the original chocolate orange. I don't know how I feel. You know what it reminds me of? What Skittles. Yeah, this yeah. This tastes like a Skittle. Maybe that's but why. But with some chocolate. Maybe that's why I'm like. It's yeah. Some, I used to eat Skittles. So that's that's probably the only. It candy tastes more I like a was... Skittle than it does like a chocolate orange. It tastes like an orange Skittle, hmm. with like a little bit of chocolate flavor, but not a ton of chocolate Is flavor. It? Just a little bit. I think it's the crunchiness of the candy bit mm-hmm. for me. I can't, I can't put my finger on it. But yeah, you're right. Maybe it's like a little mix of this and that. But but of the two orange things, I definitely like the Cadbury better because that was just very smooth. Mm-hmm. And I think the the candy shell of this is kind of throwing me off a little bit. It is. It I, is. I don't love it. It's a little. I thought I would like it better, but I don't love it. It's a little too thick, I think. And it's a little too sweet. Maybe that's why. It's a little too sweet. Like yeah. I, I'm just eating it right now, and <clears throat> I just got the last bits of it and i'm just chewing it down it's a little hard and too sweet for me and the other one is just completely smooth chocolate right mm-hmm, and mm-hmm. not too not too overwhelmingly sweet i think that's why it's it's a little off-putting but i think maybe for you know people in this country america maybe they would enjoy this because of the, yeah, the extra sweetness i, of I it. feel like this would do uh, not badly here yeah I don't know that you can really find it here that much because these were all uh, imported things that I ordered online. Was it expensive? No. The, oh. So, um, totally non-sponsored. They have no idea who I am. Oh. But I, uh, just to plug uh, Yummy Bazaar a little bit, I order from them every now. They have a lot of like Asian products. They have a lot of European products. And they have it all for reasonable prices, which I really love. Um, so, maybe, like, all maybe. of these probably cost the equivalent of what they would have cost if you were in the UK and bought them. I see. Maybe so you need to it's not send them this video, Allison. I know. Sponsor like, us. Hey, Send us so. more candy. I don't know if that's a good idea. <laughs> I, I feel like I'm just going to have... just going to end up with diabetes it's at like, this point. I have, I have, like, a handful of companies that I use for these snack attacks, and I'm like... Should I really approach them? Yeah. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. know if that's very good for my health. I think it's it's like, better. I don't know if we should be doing more yeah, of these. It's better this way. We already have a lot. Just, yeah, you just do what you're, you know, you're, you're, you can do and, and not overdo it. Imagine. Because there are like those like Japan boxes too. Yeah. And I'm just like, that's, imagine I'm so getting... tempted. I really want like a sponsorship. But at the same time, yeah. does my health appreciate that? I don't know. No. I don't know. Imagine getting sponsored by Lay's chips or something, and then you, they just send you a bunch of chips. Or Kit Kat. Or Kit Kat. Oh, my God. I would just, <laughs> yeah, definitely diabetes Every control. Every single <laughs> flavor. I'll probably be so sick of it. Uh, I say that, but. I know. I guess if you spread it out. I, I think if okay. you spread it out, you would, yeah. you would enjoy all yeah. the different flavors. Yeah. If you just take, like, one bite of it and then just, you know, we, give the rest to one. family or something. And that's what we usually I do. I think that's, that's okay, but. Other than, more than that, I think it's too much. Even right now, I'm like all oh, sugar <laughs> up right now. I'm I'm ready to, I don't know. I'm ready to run around the circle or something right now. Oh, it's too hot. Yeah, too hot. Okay, so <sighs> final ranking. Which were your favorite? Which were your mm, least favorite from today? I think the chocolate. The 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 chocolate. The chocolate. <laughs> yeah, the chocolate really? one's the best one. And also out the worst. Of all this. I like the, you, you know. All these have confusing name and I'm not used to them, but I'm gonna just tell you that the orange one, the orange chocolate one's good. I like that the bunny probably one? the best. I guess the third, the fourth one. Okay. The fourth one I think is good. The one the the, the chocolate uh, orange chocolate one's the best. The last one is probably the worst. I don't like okay. that that last one with the crunchy one, mm-hmm. the crunchy uh, out out of shell. Um, and then the the the. Wait, what's the second one again? The second one is the, the Kinder one. The Kinder one's probably the, the second one. The second one I like, <clears throat> and then the third would be the um, the Oreo one, and then the rest is whatever. I I think my least favorite three would have been the um the the hard shell chocolate one, mm-hmm. just like you, mm-hmm. the uh the hot cross one. That was just kind of mm, yeah. Like I liked all of them, but yeah. least favorite and the Oreo. 
Oh, not, you don't like the Oreo? Not my favorite. I like the Oreo. <clears throat> yeah. Whereas my top two would be the uh, the the chocolate orange mousse one, just mm-hmm. like you, and the Kinder. Yeah. Um, I think those those were my favorite too. Of, yeah. Of everything. Yeah. And then right in the middle was the uh, the Cadbury cream egg. Yeah. So. <clears throat> I think I think you can kind of tell that our taste is is more <laughs> towards. Yeah, it's more towards uh not too sweet. Yeah. More sweet, more, more uh, smooth, more uh, <laughs> a little bit fruity, mm. kind of you know balance. Balance, I think, is the key here. So, Asian. Pretty much, pretty much. <laughs> <laughs> fruit, not too sweet. Yeah, yeah. Not too sweet, yeah, and fruit definitely. We're pretty typical. Yeah. We're not that exciting. <laughs> yeah, but I think it's a. Uh, I'm I'm ready. Like I said, I'm just kind of all sugar up right now. Woohoo! A little. I'm glad we didn't like ha- we didn't Jittering. have tea. I know. Before this, that's, it would just be the overload. Like, we had no extra sugar before be this because I knew we were going to be sugared up after yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Let's just start the stream right All now. All right, let's do it. Let's stream. Let's do some gaming <laughs> stream or something on Twitch. But anyways, yeah, yeah. I think it's good. It was. I, a, I think that was a, a fun little snack attack to, yeah. to do for Easter. It was a good excuse for me to get random candy. Yeah, for sure. And I think it's a, it was a nice uh, education for me coming from... Uh, Grow a, non- a childhood candy. where yeah, yeah we don't really have um maybe you know my first 10 years of my life would be like uh if you have to count i can count the the number of time i have had chocolate it may be on two hands that's that's you know and that, those are special special times special occasion and i remember i think my dad would would he would go on business trip and he would buy these chocolate bar and we would i would probably I think I remember just storing it somewhere and divvy up with my brother and storing it somewhere and then forget to eat it. Oh, no. It's like a pack rat. And I just forget to eat it. It's like, I'm just going to store it here. Uh-huh. Nobody will. It's mine now and it's special. And then I'll just forget to eat it for years. Out of sight, out of mind. Yeah. Yeah. Dang but, it. but yeah, it's a. I'm glad, though, because otherwise I'm probably going to be a lot. Uh, maybe. Your, your so. sweet tooth has gotten much more developed since you met me. Yeah, but but not uh, not too developed <laughs> that it'll become a problem, right? So I think no, that's not good. too bad. But <laughs> but definitely a lot worse than when. Well, you uh, did used to survive yeah. on those uh, yeah. circus cookies. That's just that's just because I was cheap and in college, <laughs> and I was like, oh look, a bag of cookies. I'm gonna eat this for the next two days. It's like all of your meals. Yeah, good deal. I spent like four bucks, five bucks. I could eat for pink and white days. Cookies. Yeah, ah, not a good idea. But anyways, ah, the days when we used to be able to do that. <laughs> yeah, I would be so sick. Even right <laughs> now, I'm feeling kind of. I know when we get off this, I'm gonna feel like, oh man, well, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna go drink a lot of water just to <laughs> dilute the amount of uh, unsure glucose. Unsure yourself a little bit. Yeah, sugar, sugar that I have consumed. But yeah, so. We're over sugared. Hope you have a good Easter if you celebrate. And uh, we'll see you next time with more Snack Attack. Yes, hopefully maybe savory this time. Maybe. Okay, bye-bye. We are back with an Easter version of Snack Attack. But I was supposed to pause for you. <laughs> <laughs> Snack attack. You're so loud. Sorry. Wow, you, you are very loud. You need me to loud. be less.